Today's video is a collaboration with Hosted by Chrissy for her Dollar Tree DIY challenge. The challenge is to create a project using only Dollar Tree items. So everything you see here came from the Dollar Tree, a plunger, a cake pan, a mirror, four forks, twine, and five rolling pins. And if you wanna see what I made out of them, stick around. The first thing I did was take this liquid nails and this cake pan and this mirror and glued them together. The liquid nails needs about 24 hours to completely dry so I covered it with this weight and let it sit for about a day. And then I got the plunger and one of the rolling pins and I marked the line where I'm going to glue the rolling pin to the end of the plunger. I got a couple of zip ties to hold the pieces together and I let that sit for about a day as well. I then glued the plunger to the bottom of the cake pan. I used weights to hold this together as well and I let it dry overnight. Once I had the first rolling pin securely attached to the top of the plunger, I used that as the anchor to hold the other four, so I proceeded to glue the rest of those on. I used a bit of hot glue to hold these pieces together because I didn't want to wait the whole time for them to stick and I didn't know what the best way would be to keep them secure. So the hot glue held it together while the liquid nails dried. I glued the twine around the five rolling pins just to give some added security to make sure that they were held nicely together. And this is how it looked when everything was all complete. My original plan was to use the forks to stabilize the mirror, but once everything was put together, I didn't even need to use those. Next, I covered the mirror part with Glad Press and Seal, and I spray painted everything with metallic silver paint. We were allowed incidental items in this challenge, so I covered the twine areas with this diamond wrap that I already had, and I uh, used that on the bottom part, also on the top area of twine, and then around the mirror.
I use the diamond wrap on the inside rim of the mirror as well. And this is the finished product. Everything was $9 in total. So the mirror, the cake pan, the plunger, and the five rolling pins, also the twine, all added up to $9. The incidental items used were the glue, the spray paint, and the diamond wrap. And I'm really using this item in our sitting room in between two chairs. I used to have actually a stool in this area that I had spray painted gold. And I had this plant sitting on it. I'm like, no, I need something else, something that looks a little more flashy. So this was the perfect creation for that space. If you're interested in what the other participants came up with, the link to the playlist is in the description box. And as always, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.